This year's international symposium was held under the theme Partnerships, a catalyst in saving lives and businesses. The event, which was attended by many significant dignitaries such as the Japanese ambassador to Sri Lanka, Akira Sugiyama, commander of the Sri Lanka Navy, Vice Admiral Pial de Silva, and the chairman of APAD, Faisal Jalal. Group director of the Capital Maharaja organization, Shevan Daniel, was also present at the occasion as a panelist of the forum. Robust, resilient infrastructure and good governance are a government's commitment to sustainable development. In order to reduce disaster damage and be resilient, there must be a close combination of one, self-help efforts rooted in the awareness of people and companies, mutual help efforts of various community-based organizations, and thirdly, public help efforts made by the national and local governments. Among the disaster-prone countries in Asian continent, Sri Lanka is also in forefront. Sri Lanka Navy Diving Unit engaged in flood relief duties and other calamities responding to save lives, provide relief and recovery along with other naval personnel. In the context of disaster relief, SLN is not only limited to extend her services only to Sri Lanka but to the regional countries. Hence it is evident that disasters have a direct impact on sustainable development and countries' debt rate. Another subject of today's symposium, robust infrastructure and business resilience, is also vital for ensuring the continuity of the economy and social functions of the country. Mitigating the vulnerability for this country is one of the priority areas of Japan's Official Development Assistance, ODA, to Sri Lanka. Currently, Japan extends ODA for implementing projects like landslide disaster protection of national roads and establishment of a Doppler weather radar network. Several panel discussions focused on forging bonds in saving lives and ambitious coalitions disrupt industry norms for sustainable development were held during this forum.